Welcome back to English Word of the Day with Chris. Our word for today is frown. Frown. This is a verb and the definition to contract the brow in displeasure or concentration, to give evidence of displeasure or disapproval by or as if by facial expression. Our examples. Uber and other ride-sharing apps frown upon eating while riding. Alex Beggs, Bon Appetit, 16th of July, 2022. So, in this case, frown. So, we often say it's frowned upon. If something is frowned upon, it's something that is not acceptable. It's something that's deemed unacceptable in society, maybe. Um, in this case, it's the Uber and other ride-sharing apps frown upon uh, eating while being driven somewhere because they don't want their cars getting dirty or potentially messy, I guess. So, frowned upon. So, we have to think about literally looking at someone with disapproval because they're eating in your car. Our next example, the researchers administered an anxiety and depression questionnaire to 25 females, half of whom had received frown-inhibiting Botox injections. Brian Robinson, Forbes, 10th of August, 2022. Uh, interesting quote. I thought this was, this was quite interesting. I don't know where this is from. Um, but so if something's inhibited it means that it's stopped uh, or it's prevented from being able to do its function so a frown inhibitor would stop you from being able to frown so botox these injections that some people have for various reasons um, but they can actually stop you from being able to frown which is why some people uh, refer to others with um, extensive Botox as saying they, they cannot show facial expressions so they can't produce a frown so this look that you give where you sort of I don't know, almost trying to look through someone with disapproval and our last example here baseball traditionalists may frown but for the younger set the bananas, wildly popular on platforms like YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram, have strong appeal. <laughs> strong appeal. Uh, I didn't notice that the first time. That's actually quite funny. Um, Dom Amore, Hartford Current, 5th of October, 2022. Anyone wondering why I was laughing there? So, uh, this is what we could call a pun. Uh, so, a play on words. Um, so, I will let you figure the pun out for yourselves, see if you can, if not, no worries, uh, also write in the comments if you really can't, and I will let you know. Okay, so in this case, we have traditionalists, so people that like something the way it used to be done, um, or maybe currently is done. Um, so any change to that would be frowned upon. It's something that's looked at with disapproval. Um, I think the bananas are maybe... Well, as we can see, they're, they're very popular on platforms like YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram, which automatically would make them no longer traditional. Um, and I think they're very... Um, unique, let's say. They're not quite like other teams maybe would be. And for that reason, anyone that's a traditionalist would frown upon them. They would look upon them with disapproval. So, moving on to our synonyms, we have pout, grimace, give a dirty look, glower, glare. And last but not least, our etymology. I'm not going to read it this time, but I will leave it on the screen for anyone that would like to. And um, I'm going to thank you all, as usual, for anyone that's watching my videos. Greatly appreciated. 
if you could leave a like um, or subscribe or share, comment, it would be greatly appreciated again. Um, and I hope you'll have a lovely rest of your day. Take care. All the best. Bye for now. Bye-bye.